time isn't bad always. We are not lying to hide that we have boyfriends. We are not lying to hide that we got low marks in exams. We are not lying to create an outstanding image among our peers. Heck, we don't lie for those rubbish. <coughs> but maybe sometimes. But why do we lie mostly for it? To cover up our emotions. To save people from danger. To maintain our privacy. Buddy, that's important, buddy, that's important. To summarize, you should know how to lie like a pro, man, like a pro. Disclaimer, I'm not encouraging anyone to lie for a bad purpose. But are you good enough to lie professionally like me? Yeah, like me. You know, I've never been caught when I try to tell a whooper. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you guys are doing well. So in today's video, I'm gonna give out some genius way to lie like a professional. Again, disclaimer, this video is only for entertainment and educational purposes and I'm not responsible for the consequences that probably can be caused by the information that I provide in this video. So if any parents are watching these videos, dear uncles and aunties, please take note. Now, without delaying, let's get into the topic. Way number one is to trust your skills. Do not tell the truth even if you have lost your confidence. Don't assume that the person you are lying to knows that you are lying or something. Remember, they can only identify lies at the rate of 50 person. You know why? Because we are human, not God. You human, I human, everyone human. Way number two is to stick with your story. Remember your story well and don't even change a minor detail of your story. Because even a smallest adjustment to your story is most likely to raise a doubt in a skeptical listener. Way number three is to keep your lies believable. Create a story that makes sense and make sure it is possible for reality. Don't ever copy paste any scene from a film, especially when it's come to your parents. Then your death is confirmed. If you're trying to lie to your parents, try to create a lie that makes sense perfect that fit their knowledge. Why? Because they are way more smarter than us. You can say Sangamitra, I'm more intelligent than them, Sangamitra. I have knowledge beyond their knowledge, Sangamitra, this Sangamitra, that Sangamitra, but that won't even work, trust me. <laughs> we silly kids. <laughs> number four is to keep your mouth shut. It doesn't mean that you have to stay quiet until the problem is solved. You just have to say what absolutely you have to say. If there is no need, make sure you keep your teeth shut to a minimum and don't say anything suspicious. Way number five is to maintain a normal body language. Breathe slower. I know when you're telling a lie, your heart pumps hard and you can literally hear your heart beat. But try to breathe normally and don't show the tension on your face because that will be obvious to them. Lean in and make sure the distance between you and the person that you're talking to is less to seem more trustworthy. And don't ever say this profusely. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. Because this might raise a doubt in them that you might be lying. Psychology says that. Therefore, I hope that all the five tips that I gave you to lie professionally will be helpful for you guys in your future for only good motive. That is all for today's video and thank you so much for watching my video. Give it a thumbs up if you like this video and find this video helpful and share this to your friends who will need this and subscribe to my youtube channel if you want more videos like this. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Peace you.